glass and stainless steel that will encase the Freedom Tower in New York City, made in Oregon, being wrapped and ready to ship. What you've been working on for two years, all of a sudden it's come into place, and it's time to ship and start letting America see what we got coming. Benson Industries of Portland got the $160 million contract to make the panes and corner pieces back in April of 2004. They've been designing and building the pieces they call curtain walls ever since. It will cover more than 100 floors of the new skyscraper, part of replacing the World Trade Center towers. The pallets mark WTC1, Freedom Tower. It's a neat feeling because everybody's so involved with it, you know, and everybody wants to turn out special. And all the way from ground up, it's just something that's phenomenal to get to work as part of the USA. Nearly one million square feet to cover the 1,776-foot Freedom Tower. Still working on the final pieces, most ready to go. An Oregon connection to something much more than a building. What America stands for, you know, the, the resilience to be able to bounce back and, and create. And uh, I think this, this project does it. It says it all. These massive corner units will be the first to ship out on Monday, but Benson's work won't be done. They have crews heading to New York City to erect all this to build the Freedom Tower over the next few years. In Northeast Portland, Tim Gordon, Coin Local 6.